Hi, I'm Matthew Gatland, and this is Caves Game. This week I added a new enemy. You can see one here. The most interesting thing about it is that it has pathfinding, so it can find you effectively wherever you go trying to run away from it. Getting pathfinding working in caves is a bit different from how it's been in any of my previous games, where the world is usually built around a grid. On a grid, you can pretty much construct a path by making a, a creature move from square to square. But in caves, there aren't squares, there are triangles, and the triangles are all different shapes, and you sometimes can't fit into a triangle. Um, for example, I just created a triangular hole, which is empty space you can theoretically move through, but in practice, that triangle is too small for anything to actually fit inside. If I turn on this cheat code, you can actually see the path that the wasp creature is using to get to me. The path is usually but not always possible to follow. At the moment I'm using a cheat solution that Jonathan Rogers suggested to me a couple of days ago, which is that the creature simply can walk through walls. So you'll notice occasionally as it's chasing you, the corners of the wasp will clip through the walls of the level. That's okay for now, I'm probably going to continue to improve it and try and make its movement a bit more convincing and less jiggly. But that's most of the changes I did this week. The point of the wasp, in terms of like gameplay um, mechanics, is it's quite a dangerous enemy, and if it catches you, it explodes and kills you. So the idea is that as you're exploring the caves, you occasionally see a cavern, possibly full of wonderful treasure, but which also has a wasp in it then you have to make the decision whether you will dig into that cave and release the wasp, or whether you'll try and avoid it. It's also easy to accidentally dig a hole into a cave while you're trying to fight an enemy, and these mines make the situation even worse. So I'm hoping wasps will add a bit of drama to the game. That's all for this week. See you next time.